Construction 12, constructing a triangle given two angles and the length of side that's in between those two angles. We're going to use compasses, protractor, ruler and pencil. So firstly we need to visualise what we're going to be uh, creating so that we don't make any mistakes. So let's assume we've got a triangle uh, ABC where one side AB is 9 centimetres and that angle CAB is 50 degrees and angle ABC is 45. So let's just visualise that. Let's draw ourselves a triangle, just a sketch, A, B, C. Okay, so the side AB is 9 centimetres. The angle of CAB, so C, A, B, i.e. this angle here is created is going to be 50 degrees. And angle ABC, so A, B, C, each time, think of this journey, A to B to C, and I, as I say as I before, the angle, the point that it is actually, the angle is actually at is the middle letter. So A, B, C creates this angle here of 45 degrees. That's what we want to actually uh, be able to create properly to scale. So the first thing we do is we're going to draw our line, our line AB. So with a ruler and a pencil, and the draw line is of length 9 centimetres. Let's lay that up, A and B. Now what we now need to do is create two angles. One angle at this end of the line segment and another angle at the other end of this line segment. So the first one is 50 degrees. So we line up a protractor, centre on the end of the line segment, line of protractor in line with my line segment. It's going through this knot here, so I'm going to use the inside scale. So moving up to 50 on the inside scale and out, create a marker, which I can now join up with A and extend beyond. I'll do the same process again this time at B. This angle is going to be 45 degrees. So again, I position my protractor correctly. I'm now going to be using the outside scale of the protractor. So starting here at naught, work my way around until I get to 45. Again, draw a line from B through this marker. And where they intersect is my point C. You may wish to just uh, if it's construction lines, you may wish to firm those lines up, up to C. I would recommend you don't remove the constructions. For examination purposes, the examiner will probably want to see how you construct, and by showing those, uh, they understand what you probably did.